Wheeler expects seven days of grooming. And if that trail's rough, they expect you to be out there again. And that's fine. If they want that and expect that, they're going to have to pay for it because we can't take money out of our back pocket and put it on a state program because I get that slam in my face. <laughs> it's a state program. It's <coughs> state dollars. Yeah, it is, but it came from snowmobilers, not from a backpacker, not from a Joe Blow that sits in the coffee shop drinking coffee, whining about taxes. <coughs> it comes from Johnny, Joe, Billy Bob, John, Henry, snowmobiler, and grant sponsors. Because on our, on our groomers, we buy a trail stickers stick it on our groomers. We help. We help. That's just one. That's one way we move. Last year it was what eight billion gallons of uh, fuel sold. If that if that's not right, uh, that's right. Eight billions. Eight billion gallons of fuel sold. Now, get this formula straight, Bill. There is gasoline formula, right? Okay, just 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 stop now because these these are all grant sponsors. When you say fuel, they're thinking diesel. Oh, this is gasoline. Yeah, yeah, this is gasoline. Sold in the state. Okay, hold on. Yeah, I speak. This is this is the total number of gallons of gasoline sold in one year in the state of Michigan. Right. Eight billion. Eight billion. Now, out of that comes a factor of there's we get two percent of fourteen percent. No, 14% no. of 2%. Excuse me, yeah, okay, there you go. 2% of the tax, tax on gasoline on each gallon. So the state has 19 cents a gallon tax, something to that, that effect. So out of that 19 cents a gallon times 8 billion, we 2% goes to the make up what's called the Recreational Improvement Fund. Okay. So, so you can see where there's not a hell of a lot of money comes there, but there's money. So it's 25, 30 million. Makes up the fund. Boaters get 80 percent. Snowmobilers get 14 percent. Others get 6 percent. That 14 percent equates to about 2.5 million dollars. Yep. But you're going to see that Take it, it has been going down, and you're going to see it continue to go down because less gallons are being sold, even though we're paying more for gas. Less gas, and, the, and it's only the tax on gallons. So even though everybody thinks wrong on that, they think, oh, gasoline is the way up there, so we're getting more money. We're not. We're getting less because people are driving less. The usage is going down, so our percentage is going to go down on the amount of money we get. In fact, down there, estimating probably for next year, you're only going to see about two million going into our fund versus two point four. Yep. Last year, last year was two million three hundred and sixty-five thousand. Seven hundred and fifty-three dollars and ten cents. It was a long day in that groomer. I had to do something. Okay. <laughs> okay. Well, now really, it came from Jim. Like I was just writing it down in the groomer, going, "Holy shit, that money! Where's it at now?" Okay. So, anyways, registered sleds in the state of Michigan. Not in. The, it's not in the increase. It's on a decline. Bill and I had a conversation about that this morning. <clears throat> Registration, there was 3,000 brand new sleds bought last year. 3,000. What's that? New brand new sleds registered in the state of Michigan this past season. Yep. Okay, and I'll just give you an indication. In the 90s, we were registering, in 99, we registered 28,000 new sleds that year. 2,000, 21,000. 2001, 20,000. 2002, 29,000 new sleds were sold and registered in Michigan. <coughs> then the decline starts in 2004. We only had 13,000. Then there was a spike of 20,000 in 2005. I wonder how many were sold. And this reports as of April 1st. So registrations 2,800. 2,800 new sleds were sold in the state of Michigan. Okay. Registered. So what does that tell you about registrations? They're down. <laughs> money, that money stream is what? <clears throat> Sliding away. Okay? Again, a lot of the economy and the whole nine yards. I mean, it's, I'm just, I'm, I'm throwing these numbers out so we can understand that. How that equates. Equates. How that equates to the fund. 
Yes. We we get five dollars from every registration into the snowmobile fund for that three for for that year. So when you register, even though it's a three year registration, you get five dollars goes into the snowmobile trail improvement fund. Okay? In the past you were getting that five dollars times twenty nine thousand or twenty thousand sluts. This year we got five dollars times twenty eight hundred sluts. Yes, Bill. What about renewals? Yeah, that's renewals. Well, that's yeah. We do, renewals are there, but they were down also. But what, I, I'm just trying to point yeah. out the de the decline here. That but what I'm thinking is maybe they're keeping their sleds longer too. Oh, they, no so doubt about it. No yeah. doubt about it. And, and that's a factor. I'm just I'm just trying to yeah. throw. I'm just kind of show numbers. I'm not I'm trying, trying to, to not make that one go down too low. It might. Well, <laughs> and and right now even so even the we I, used to we used to see the registrations it was a low and then it spiked up and then dropped back low <laughs> right now we're pretty stagnant right across there's about 86 that, um, let's see that are going to come up for expirations in 2008 in September so in other words people there's 86,000 going to going to go away that need to renew uh, now the following year is 87,000 and the following year is 86,000 those numbers used to be about 95 95 95 so we've lost roughly about 10,000 a year that people are not a registering their sleds or have chosen not to, aren't running them, whatever. So, I mean, that's a factor It's there, and we're seeing it, it's in a decline, we can see that. So, I mean, that, that factors into the dollars and cents of where we're going to pull the money from. Okay, and then to top this off is the registration is in a decline. Obviously, with the lack of new s sleds being sold, that's a decline. Now let's talk about trail permits. Two hundred and two hundred thousand five hundred and thirty trail permits were sold a year, two years ago. Last season. Yeah, last season. Okay, thank not you. this past. Not that's yet. So yeah, season. last. Okay, two hundred two hundred thousand five hundred and thirty. Now, last season, it was down 40,000 permits, I, I'm just rough numbers. Um, this came out to be just about 29,000. <coughs> By the time they got it, we got all the facts figures up. It was all, tw okay, so it wasn't 20? No, close to 30,000. Okay, 30,000. Take 30,000 times 25 bucks. That's a lot of dollars and cents gone. This year, we don't have the final numbers. We don't have the final numbers, but it looks like it's going to run pretty true to last year. Okay. Talked to the Bray Banner today. He said it looks like it's definitely down again this year. Yeah. So, okay, that's, that's, okay, so now we're down, now we're down below from.